What up my love bugs? It's your girl Noni here and we're coming back in for another game. Now this game is called The Haunted Mansion. Now your girl Noni, she can do like a five in a scare mood here. Because the monster house was like a one or two, really a one. But let's go ahead and get started. We're gonna go normal. As a lifelong author, I have often drawn inspiration for the more chilling of my tales from my own experiences as a young man living in Louisiana after the Civil War. Oh, but the story of Ezekiel Halloway, that I have not dared tell before now. In October of 1879, Zeke was unmarried and ever the dreamer. Years spent in orphanages had taught him nothing if not self-reliance. But the endless struggle to find employment increasingly took him beyond the outskirts of New Orleans itself, even into the surrounding unfamiliar countryside. So it was that on this particular cold and dreary afternoon, he found himself at a rather remote and mournful estate, inquiring about the position of assistant caretaker. <clears throat> mm. He certainly looks like a nice young man. Young beggar, more likely by the looks of him. Aye, beggar or not. We hate in no position to be chosen. Do you think he's ready for something like this? We'll see how he holds up under fire soon enough, I reckon. Enough already. Let us introduce ourselves. Ah! Arr, that's gonna leave a mark. Hurry now! She will be expecting him. Mm -mm. Ghost off the bay? He's back! Oh, I hope he's feeling better. Bad. I told you he'd be on his feet again in no time. Come! We have done our part for now. She is on her way. Oh. Awakened now from troubled sleep, you find yourself where shadows creep. The mansion hides its history but solve you will this mystery and find the truth that's buried deep beneath these halls where spirits weep oh i child am madame leota speaker of the spirit world medium of the mysterious and seeker of things unseen <laughs> i know why you're here even better than you do yourself assistant caretaker it is and you are ezekiel but you prefer zeke <laughs> we couldn't just have the newspaper ad read wanted brave soul to rid haunted mansion of evil spirits now could we <laughs> if we had you wouldn't be here now and the fate of this house and all who dwell within it would be sealed forever this house was once home to many friendly ghosts but a powerful, evil man named Atticus Thorne has taken over the estate, corrupting the memories of many of the ghosts and turning others into evil spirits to serve his will. Our beloved mansion has become a dark and foreboding place, and we are now Thorne's prisoners locked within it. But our hope lies with you, Zeke. We need your help to defeat this evil and to rescue our ghostly friends. An ancient artifact will aid us in this effort. A sacred lantern known as the Beacon of Souls. It is a source of light and power and can be used to battle any <laughs> evil right. forces we encounter. Unfortunately, Thorn will also be using his dark magic to try and stop us. He'll be creating magical barriers throughout the mansion twisting the very rooms themselves until we can turn on the lights and undo his spells. While not all of our foes fear the light, it will weaken the lesser evil spirits and force them into hiding, 
Once found, these shriveled souls can be chased from their hiding places and drawn into the beacon. Here, the soul's corruption will slowly be reversed, returning them to their good and former selves. As the good power of these souls increases in the beacon, their energy will enable us to break down the magical barriers that Thorn has erected. Then, we may gain access to more areas of the mansion. But there is more I have to tell. <clears throat> the primary source of the beacon's power lies in the six sacred gems that adorn it. They are called soul gems. Now, to keep them out of Thorn's hands, I had my ghostly friends hide five of them somewhere in the mansion. And the beacon still has one soul gem in place. This allows it to function, but very okay. weakly. All right. So we must find the other five to restore its power completely. I'm sorry if you find this confusing, Zeke, but I'm afraid we have little time and much to do. I'll ride along in your satchels, so hold it open and I'll just roll- Oh! oh wait! Wait! Oh, uh, you don't mm. need to- Fingerprints! Watch the fingerprints! Man, that was the longest intro I've ever seen. The light switch is over there. Use the activate button on the switch to light up the room. I don't start off by saying, bro look terrified and dehydrated. Oh my goodness, that was a long intro. Okay, we got five lives. Uh-uh, why he sneaking? Ooh, y'all, look how he run. Hold on. What am I supposed to do with that? Uh-oh. Fight off these evil spirits with a rapid shot by pressing the fire button. To attack a specific enemy, hold down the lock-on button. All right. I mean, he going in a straight line. Oh, no, hold on, fast. Fast. All right. What's this? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. He went through me? What the heck is wrong with these people? Hmm, hold on, they gonna, they gonna keep on top. Turn on light. How you turn on light again, B? We losing oh, life already. There we go. Now that the lights are on, you'll be less afraid, and your bravery measure will reflect this. Oh, thank you. <sighs> Y'all think I'm about to read that long With thing? With the lights on, find shriveled souls by searching objects, then pull them into the beacon by holding down the soul collector button. You can find out how many shriveled souls are still hiding in a room by looking at the soul counter down on the lower left. He got zero, right? Zero and fifteen. What? What is it? Zero or fifteen? Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait. They say X, right? Some things look weird. Anna. To pull more than one shriveled soul at a time into the beacon, tap the soul collector button once for each soul before holding it down. I'm not gonna lie, I feel like I'm not gonna remember all this, y'all. Okay, we got 11 left. Wait, that's all from that one? Let me see. Yeah, that's all from that one. Alright. He said, tap it. Shoot, I'm tapping it. Oh, come on now. Taking this sweet time to get in there. Pause, pause, pause. Ooh. Okay, I see the wallpaper. Okay, all I saw was extra life, really. All right, so you this get an extra life there. 
one's magic. But don't worry, you can break down these spirit barriers by pressing activate when we have enough shriveled souls in the beacon. Okay, I got seven left. Okay. I mean, I checked the... I only see two of them in here. How the feet? You expect me to just press B anywhere? Man. Ooh. Okay. We go down here. Wait, the end's where I came into. Can I go? Okay. Alright. He killing me with that sneaking though. Okay, okay. Ooh. Congratulations! You found part of an old death certificate. Collect all the pieces and take them to the proper friendly ghost to earn a reward. Man, I really hope they ain't got no puzzles in this game. Ooh, a card. Hold on, where they go? What? What the heck, man? B. B right here, yeah. Oh, it's moving. Alright, that's everybody. Three more. Oh, I see it. Come on, that one too far away. Ain't got no that's other item. Once you've collected all the shriveled souls from a room, you're ready to explore more of the mansion. Press activate to open the door. Okay. Okay, so she must be in my little pouch right here. Oh, I got another car. Uh-uh. I ain't see you right there. What the heck you doing? Why you hiding? What you hiding from? Hold on, we hide together. Hmm, don't scare me. Let me go. Yeah, he got that awkward run. Okay, so ghost is just popping out the um the walls and stuff now out of nowhere or something. He got that I got you walk. No, not that I got you. He got that I got you run. That walk is just like, mm, I'm just gonna sneak a little bit. But let's get out of here. Alright, so how you um did you press B or something? I thought that was gonna take some of my life. All right, let's go in. Uh-uh. That Grim Reaper? Oh, that's the beautiful, oh. They need let me finish, but I saw her side. Oh, I see a light switch. You get her on it, come on. Can he run? A little something? <gasps> okay. As we travel through each room in the mansion, the energy of souls long past still lingers. Sometimes, this energy will allow me to communicate with those souls in the afterlife. By channeling them, I may be able to gain hints Ooh. and clues that will help us in our journey. Man, I really hope I remember all this, because ain't nobody. Mm, anybody got time for this? Oh, oh, I see a life thing right there. Okay. Can I can I go upstairs? No. Oh, oh, I see a card. Oh, what the hell is that? Hey, the girl don't like spiders. No. Uh, not like a freaking have alien spider too. Come on, move. How do you get rid of them? Oh, what the hell, man? Uh uh. I do not like no freaking spiders. All because I want a freaking card? And he like, no, okay. All right, where the spirit thing at? We when said, oh. the easy way, you cannot climb. A crooked path could save you time. Okay, now we got rhymes now, huh? We rhyming now, huh? A crooked path could save you time. But he couldn't even. Oh, I don't. Want, I don't want to take that life. Can I go in that door? Okay. Hey. Oh, 
one. All right, come on now. Oh, I can't go in the door either. Wait, no, I got 15 and a... Come on. Let's be... Seven... 170 spirits needed. I know they're not all in this room, huh? Let me see how much you need in here. Okay. Wait, I came in from that way, huh? No, I came in from this way, huh? I don't know no more, y'all. 30. Ah, this will save you time later. Activate the grandfather clocks you find throughout the mansion to save your game progress. Oh, thank you. Come on. Are you, is it saving? Don't scare me like that. Okay, you guys. So we figured it out. Huh. Oh, freaking A. I'm over here jumping like the spider like is actually in my house. Oh my goodness. Okay, so it took a second. It took a I ain't gonna lie, it took a little minute. Cause your girl not good with no puzzles. But you supposed to move this. Wait, right, what was it? Blue? I said blue B. Ooh. Are we in a painting now? Okay. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and start part one right here since the intro was so long. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Go ahead and fly right to that like button. Tell me which is our other video in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.